Go. Every year, the monarch butterflies come to the milkweed field behind Grandma Timberman's cottage. Usually, a huge number arrives. Then each day, some of them disappear. This year, there was 2,000 butterflies. One on the first day after they arrive, a hundred disappear. On the second day, twice the amount disappear, or 200 butterflies are gone. Each day, the number of butterflies that disappear doubles from the number that leaves the day before. How many days will it take for all butterflies to disappear? So basically, what we did, first we did this, and to just track down how like what the numbers would be, and we went a little too far, but so there was two thousand butter butterflies for the start, and then the first day a hundred disappear. So then it says to double the amount. So and it says two hundred. So a hundred times two would be two hundred. Then two hundred times two would be four hundred. Four hundred times two would be eight. 100. Then 800 times 2 would be 1600. Then 1600 times 2 would be 3200. And those are how many disappear. But as you can see, we went a little too far, but then we're going to get to our graph. So we started out with 200. Then on day one, you have to subtract 100. That gets you 1900. So the next day, which is day two, you, sub okay. you have to subtract. Okay. Remember you guys got six for the first problem? Yes. Um, what, were, what did you need to do that you didn't do? Um, we didn't make a graph. We did not make a graph, which is table. a right. table or a graph. If you, if you don't do something organized and pretty, you, you, they count as six days here. Mm -hmm. If you go here, day one, two, three, four, five. If, if you set up a table, it helps keep your stuff organized and you remember what you're looking for. Okay, so as you can see, as we keep on going, we um, subtract it until it equals zero on day five, which is minus 1,600. So that's it, and the answer is day five, five days.